Yeah, welcome back to the next video. This is gonna be our uh, 45th episode doing doing this house building series. So building house start to finish, uh, getting towards the end here. So that's that's definitely nice. But don't worry, because once this house is done, we have a whole bunch more projects to watch. But anyways, for this uh, video we're we'll gonna be doing the doors here. We got them all set up so we can get them painted and got them cleaned off and dusted. And then after that, we'll be going to the uh, baseboard and then probably painting the rest of the house here and the rest of the room. And we'll see how far we get from there. But um, yeah, we're gonna get started on, on the doors and let's see how that looks. So, got the doors painted and they dried overnight and I put them back on and while those are drying, uh, Natalie and I we went ahead and painted the trim around the doors and the baseboard and then we had a little extra time. We got the uh, hallway painted here with this final color and this little entryway here and got the door back on that one and now the next thing is to get the rest of this room painted.
Well, next day here, got the uh, painting all done yesterday. Using that big 18-inch uh, roller definitely helps out and speeds things up. But yeah, kitchen's all done here. Um, little uh, living room here is all done. Got some of the plastic finally taken off. Entryway is all done here. Kind of got some of my, my junk moved out. And waiting for the uh, electricians to come now. They should be here hopefully today to get their work done. And then um, get the heater um, connected so feel a little warm in here. Get more of the outlets connected so looking looking forward to that. But until then I have some little, uh, little touch up painting to do. Just around the uh, cabinets here and along the baseboard there and a couple of places on the doors and yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and get back to painting and hope these electricians uh, show up. Uh, I got you a video anyways. Hello. <laughs> All right so it's been a couple days here the uh, electricians have been here they put all the uh, outlets on and the switches and they still have the uh, some of the lights to do here and um, they got the outlet there for the dishwasher and then over here get a little dark outside put the uh, ceiling fan out there and they put the heater on and got that connected so it's actually nice and warm in here now so that's that's really nice and happy about that and I didn't film these guys doing the electrical work uh, I don't know not everyone likes to be on camera as much as me but anyways I got here I was gone for this morning we got, got back here came here looked on the floor yeah what do you see the problem here they didn't make a mess electricians always make a mess and these guys they put everything in just a nice little clean pot for me to pick up so I definitely appreciate that so thank you guys if you're watching this video and let's go down here yes so what we've been doing is this morning we left because we went to get the appliances and the refrigerator we wanted to get it inside and stand it up because we had to transport it laying down on the side so now we're going to just have it standing up and leave it here for a couple, like a few days before we get it plugged in, just so it doesn't ruin the compressor or anything like that. And we also have the doors off. And the doors are back up again. I think I showed that. I don't know. Did you? I might have. Well, did you show the pretty crown molding that you did? I did. Now we got the ceiling fan up in there. Everything's all ready. And while the electricians are here, hope it's not too dark in here. Went ahead and did the uh, the shower tile. So floor to ceiling, subway tile. That was a ton of work, but that's all ready. Got the floor done. Uh, so I have to do the little curb down there, but that's okay because I just had to get at least this one wall done because the electrician, or not, not the electrician, um, the plumber, he's coming tomorrow to do his work and get this all hooked up and get the the vanity and sink and all that connected. And yeah, that'll be a little bit more work. Um, I don't think he makes me on video either, so I'll show his work after he's he's done and out of here. Um, I told him I was gonna get the floor done in here so he could put the toilet down, but it's not done yet, so he might get a little excited about that, a little upset maybe. Well, you can install the toilet by yourself. Yes, yeah, so it's on the toilet. You don't have to worry. It's about super it. easy. Let me show that toilet here. We have it right over here. It's a power flush. <laughs> so I got the power flush, and just in case I ever have any billiard balls I need to get rid of, I can always flush them down the toilet. <laughs> Seven balls will flush down the toilet. So if I ever have any extras, I can get rid of them that way. But also, don't think that uh, we're gonna waste a bunch of water flushing all these billiard balls down the toilet, because this is still a nice uh, water sense toilet. 1.28 gallons for flush. So we can flush a lot of balls down the toilet. We have the visitors. What did you say, Justin? The elk are so close you can smell them. They stink. Shh. I don't know if you guys can see it. I'll try to open the screen door and I'll try to zoom. They're right there in our backyard. 
and that is the reason why we love to live here. Look at this amazing sunset. Look at those mountains. All this elk. That smell like a dirty farm. Justin. No, they're pretty. At least. I don't smell anything. I don't know. I guess you have a sensitive nose. It smells like an old farm. Look at all those elk. They're all in our backyard. This is still our property over there behind the fence. That's amazing. I don't have to whisper. They're not going anywhere. Okay. But you know our grass. Well, you can see them right out of the kitchen window as well and the bedroom uh, window as well. Uh, the window is still dirty. We still didn't clean anything here, but that's coming up. Look, you can see them hanging out right there. So you can do your dishes or do some cooking and just seeing the National Geographic right out of your window. Well, well, it's been definitely a long week. Got a lot of stuff done. Happy about that. Got the appliances. The electricians came. They had a little bit to do. And they they showed up on time. Show up when they said they were going to. That, that's, that's a great thing. Plumber's coming tomorrow. Get his work done. Another great thing. Be able to use the bathroom inside instead of the old cold uh, porta potty outside. And, oh. And you can power flush it. And I'll power flush. <laughs> But things are finally getting done here. We have just a couple couple of videos left for this house and then this is done. And then uh, maybe I'll take a day off and relax. And then it's going to be time for the next project and get that started. So that's going to be a quick one to get to. It'll just be right outside here. So that's, that's going to be a fun one. So look for that one coming up. And with that being said, that's going to be it for this video. Uh, it's getting dark here. I'm ready to go home and eat some dinner and uh, relax for the night and get this video out to you guys. So thanks for watching and we'll see you for the next one. Bye. Bye.